past five in the morning, but um, I'm doing a pregnancy test. <laughs> I can't believe I'm quite nervous actually. Um, I don't know what to think. <laughs> I've just done it. I'm just waiting for two minutes for why um, why it does its thing, and then I thought it'd be nice to record it, no matter what the result was. Um, I'm a bit nervous, not gonna lie, um, but I'm quite excited as well. Um, I think I know what it's gonna say, uh, but we'll see. Just waiting for it now. I've got 30 seconds left. Oh god, this is so, like, so nerve wracking, isn't it? No matter, like, with it. It's something you want or not, or it's just one of the things. But oh god, I'm even really nervous. I remember the last time I was so so nervous. I literally cried <laughs> just waiting. So let's see. Um, oh, 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 that's it. It's time to have a look. So if it's got a cross. It means I'm pregnant. I think that's a definite yes. I'm pregnant. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe it. I actually thought he was going to say no. Oh gosh. <laughs> well hello, welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, welcome. Like, it's really weird. It's been nine months since I last filmed um, or put anything out. So it's been a long time. Um, but I definitely missed it, but I needed the break, um, probably not as long as I took, but yeah, I'm back. For those that don't know me, and you've just stumbled across and found my channel, my name's Carly, I am mum to one little boy called Jesse, I live with obviously Jesse and my husband Terry, um, I work from home, I've recently started up my own business, um, so yeah, I work from home which is lovely. Um, we're just a normal family really nothing excited to that really exciting about us but I just love to share my my life and my experiences so that's what this is all about so I hope you stick around if you like it um, yeah and that's it so <laughs> I'm pregnant <laughs> um, yeah so I am 14 weeks pregnant at the moment. Um, I'm feeling good now. Um, they say I'm so I'm in my second trimester now. <clears throat> um, first trimester, well, it was a long slog. I found out I was pregnant when I was five weeks, so I had a long way to go before I had my scan and I could officially tell everyone. We told like friends and family but um, we didn't tell the world, as to say. So yeah, um, the first trimester, it was hard. Um, I just felt sick a lot. I was sick a lot. Um, sometimes for no apparent reason as well. But I think my eye and my pregnancy tablets did make me ill. So I have um, a tablets, I've got the Boots pregnancy tablets and they're iron, folic acid and vitamin D. I think the iron in it is what was making me ill. That's what made me ill with my last pregnancy with Jessie. So I think that's what was making me ill this time. Every time I took the tablets, I was sick, physically sick. Um, so yeah, I think that, that didn't help. So I kind of had to mix up in the day when I was taking them. I just had to take them when I was feeling okay rather than just trying to take them first thing in the morning because it just wasn't working. Yeah. 
yeah they had lots of sickness lots of nausea and I, the tiredness I you just don't I just didn't remember being that tired with Jesse and even Terry said to me um you wasn't t this tired last time but I think it's probably more of the fact that I've obviously got Jesse to look after now um I've got a house to look after so when I was pregnant with Jesse I was living at home with my mum and dad so I didn't really do anything my mum done all the housework and I think all I had to do was go to work have my dinner in the evenings and then lay in bed for the rest of the night so I think that's probably why I didn't feel as tired because I had more time to rest obviously this time I don't because I have to look out a hot house I have to I run a business um yeah so it's a lot to take on um so yeah the the tiredness did get me but thankfully I work from home now so um I could take breaks and naps whenever I wanted so that was like a godsend it's a hallelujah <laughs> so yeah but now I'm feeling much better um Oh, I just don't really know what else to say. Um, got my energy back now, so I'm raring to go for the second trimester. We're two weeks in, so we've got, what, 10 weeks left. Is it 10 weeks? I think so. 10 or 11 weeks. I think it's still 27 weeks, isn't it, your second trimester? Um, yes, yeah, so we've got a few weeks to go. Um, so, yeah, everything's bubbling nicely. So I had um, my scan on Monday just gone and um, so I was 13 weeks and three days um everything was fine I was a bit apprehensive going in um more than I was with Jessie but I think that's because since having them I've been much more aware of how the struggles that people have gone through with having kids and um I have had a few of people I know have got to that 12 week stage and have unfortunately lost their baby so I think that made me a bit more apprehensive this time about what I was going to see but everything's fine so we're all good there um scan picture there he or she is so um she was he or she um, they I'll pull them down um they were wiggling around quite a lot and um they had their back to us a lot of the time as well so it's quite hard for the is it son sonographer sonographer I don't know to get a picture but he did um, and he got quite a good one as well um, yeah I said everything's fine there was nothing really to worry about um, the baby's eight and a half centimeters long it's the size of a kiwi which is not very big at all quite about this big um, but it feels a lot bigger <laughs> Yeah, everything was absolutely fine. I was so happy. Unfortunately, Terry couldn't come to the scan with me, um, but that was fine. I was okay with that. Even though I was feeling a bit apprehensive, I was okay. He had to work, work away for the week. So my mum came with me instead, which was absolutely fine. I had my bloods done for all the different syndromes and that's all come back already. They said it's going to take about three weeks for the results to come back, but they came back today and everything's fine. There's no worries. So we are all a okay. The only worry they've got is that Jesse was a big baby. So um, I don't think I've ever told my birth story before, but with Jesse, he was 10 pounds one. Um, and I had to have him, I tried to have him naturally. I was in labor for 40 hours of him. Um, but it just wasn't working he wasn't cut he wasn't budging basically and it's probably because he was so big <laughs> um so yeah i ended up having an emergency c-section with him so um they're gonna monitor me with that because he was so big i probably will need to be tested for con i can't say it congestive ah uh, con no diabetes diabetes you get when you're pregnant i can't remember what it's called at the moment um yes i need to be tested that at 28 weeks i think it is um but apart from that that's all it really i think it's fine um i'm trying to think is there anything else to tell you so at this point now the baby is fully formed um yeah, the baby's fully formed. Uh, 
it's kicking but i can't really feel anything at the moment i do feel a kind of little flat as here and there but nothing much at all and that's probably it's probably not even a baby um and he's he's actually and he or she's weeing as well now apparently so that's lovely to know that i've got something weeing inside of me <laughs> um yeah all good um i'm gonna leave it there so thank you for watching um i hope thank you for the people that have stuck around because there's still over 200 of you subscribed to this channel which is amazing considering i haven't um i haven't posted in so long so thank you for sticking around can't wait to share this journey with you and um it's going to be exciting i'm so I, I i regret that i didn't do this with jesse so that's why i'm doing it with this one but i think i'm going to do trimesters rather than week by week because week by week's a bit tedious isn't it so the next one next update will be uh 27 weeks um and yeah and then there'll be bits and pieces in birth suite so we'll have baby related stuff in between as well but yeah that's pretty much it so yeah thanks for watching guys um and we will catch you next time on the next one thanks bye, -bye. one thing i forgot to do is show you the bump <laughs> so, um excuse if you can see my pajama bumps it's the only thing that fits me at the moment so when i'm at home i'm comfy comfy so yeah it's quite a lot bigger than i was with jesse i don't think i was even showing when i was with jesse but they say that your second you show a lot more but yeah that is it i feel like i'm more four or five months pregnant rather than three am i free yeah um but hey that's what they say you show more on the second one so i'm hoping this is not a sign of a big baby i hope this one's not as big as jesse i'm praying pray for me <laughs> uh yeah so that's it See you later. Bye.